Okay, there we go. Now we're, now we're running. Uh, I'm trying to run the battery down right now because everyone's killing me trying to get a, a charging curve video. Oh. And so I'm trying to get the battery down to like 5% so that I can go sit and charge for an hour. So, <laughs> so fun. Do you guys still have the panel over there? Yeah, I do have solar panels. Uh -huh. Nice. I'm getting it. Just got approved by the city. Oh, cool. Oh, we, we like it. Uh, I mean, it, it pretty much pays for itself, and then in 10 years, it'll be free money. So we're planning on staying around for... What's the size of your system? Uh, it's uh, 11 kilowatt. The, um, that big? We're yeah. just trying to get 6.9. Oh, yeah? Okay, how you shift is wild. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I don't know where to go. I kind of want to go to some back back roads for a little bit so I can do a couple launches. It's harder to do launches in public streets because, you know, cars. <laughs> Makes sense. Um, you don't have your seatbelt fastened, bud. Oh, do I have to? Yes, you have yes, to. Yes, you have to. What do you mean? That's a law. <laughs> I did not know that, uh, the the Passing years about it's going to be on YouTube. <laughs> you want people to know that you're a bad person? Cut that out. Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's see if we can find a good straight way that we can do launch. So the steer by wire is incredible. So like, watch this. I'm going to turn I'm turning right now, and it's just going to be. There's no stop sign. Yeah, that's weird. I think this is this is turning. Oh. Isn't that nice? I'm trying to think what happens normally. Hand over hand, hand over hand. Oh. You do multiple, usually, right? So I don't want to do one with a speed bump. Let's find a... Uh, difficult to adjust? Uh, I, th board? I thought it was going to be weird, and it was for about the first two minutes, and then your brain adjusts really quick. All right. Why are there all the cones on this one? Temporary no parking. Seems like a great place. I don't see any speed bumps on this road. Are you ready? Sure. Whoa. <laughs> I won't get all up to 60 because this is a residential street, but. <laughs> That's wild. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> this is a truck. <laughs> Isn't that nuts? Have you towed anything or? No, we haven't, not yet. Uh, I mean, we just got it last Monday, so it's still. Still in the honeymoon phase. <laughs> no, I did, not, I did not want to do a 20 hour road trip towing. Heck no. Oh, I don't think it would still be 20 hours. <laughs> yeah, seriously though. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what you guys want to do. She like it? She loves it, yeah. She drives it? This will mo mainly be her car. Oh, really? Oh. Uh, cause I, yeah, I bike to work. There you go. So, still? Still, yeah. Haven't stopped. The problem is uh, at Tesla because, I mean, it's the biggest factory in the world. Or not, I don't know about the world, but definitely in the United States. By square footage, there's no factory bigger. Um, and so, I mean, the larger a building gets, the more square footage you have, the less perimeter you have proportionally. And so the entire building is surrounded by semi-ports. And so you got to park like a mile away, and then you shuttle, you shuttle in. And so driving, when you, ha when you count like all the traffic and then parking and shuttling in, it takes me about an hour to get to my desk from my house. But what if I bike? It's like 20 minutes. That's insane. Because I can just drive right past all the traffic. Oh. And I can park right next to my desk. And so, so your house is really close to the factory? Then. Yeah, we decided to optimize for my commute because I mean that'll be happening every day. So we're a little bit farther away from amenities, but a lot closer for commute. Gotcha. Yeah. Do they have a Tesla bike coming? <laughs> if I knew, I would not be able to say, but I do, I do not know. <laughs> Did you get a Tesla solar panel? We were thinking about it, um, but uh, they weren't competitive. Could get it cheaper elsewhere. So. What about the battery? Don't they have the, the power wall? If if we were to get a power wall, we would definitely get a power wall uh, versus any other battery. Um, they say it's not that good yet. The battery, right? Uh, I, did, I didn't get it. It's pretty good. Uh, I mean, it's still a little, a little pricey. Like they, they make goes out in like ten years or something. Oh, the warranty. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure about that. That's a good question. I'm um, talking about just Tesla, but in general, the battery situation. Like, so I didn't get the. Gotcha. Battery, yeah. 
Yeah, and, well, and so this car, the main reason why I haven't gotten one is because I was excited for this car, waiting for, um, this, this car has a vehicle to home is what we're calling it. Uh, you can back up your house on your car. So your car goes out, uh, your car takes over and charges your- original charging. Yeah, uh -huh. so this is the first Tesla, That's I think wild. since the original Roadster, I'm not exactly sure. We did it at the very beginning uh, and then no one used it, so we stopped. Um, but this is the first car since that has bi-directional charging. That's wild. Yeah, I mean, and this is way better than a, than any uh, power wall would be because I mean it's like 100 That's plus true. k or kilowatt hours of battery storage, so you can run your house on this for like three days. Damn. Yeah. Seems like it's unreal. Unfortunate for charging this from your house. So. <laughs> yeah. So I, <laughs> yeah. So they, they they have a. They've got lots of different charging solutions. One you just plug into an outlet and that's like one kilowatt hour, or one kilowatt right. an hour. <laughs> um, and so that takes like days to charge your car. And then you can also plug into a 228 outlet, like a dryer port, if you have one of those uh, in your garage, which you, that you could install. And that gets you like five or six kilowatt hours, or gosh, five or six kilowatts. Um, and then they've got a destination charger that you can install that does I don't know, like 50 kilowatts or something. So you charge in like okay. four or five hours. It's not bad. So you got one in your garage? Right now we're still just trickle charging because um, this is a foundation series uh, truck, uh, which means it's one of the, the first off the line. And it also comes with the hardware for this bi-directional charging um, for free vehicle to home. But it's not quite ready yet, uh, so it hasn't been delivered. And so I'm, I'm just waiting until that, that hardware gets delivered before I do any work uh, on my garage. Okay, so have you been charging at home or do you mostly no. use charging I mean, we've stations? We've been trickle charging. So we got the car on Monday, last Monday. Um, and then- Not a lot of time. Not a lot of time. <laughs> the, the, um, the people that wrapped our car took it for a couple days. And so we, we've really only had access to our car for a little yeah, over a week. On that now. Yeah, so this, I mean, it, it will have full self-driving um, eventually. Right now it just has uh, adaptive cruise control. Yeah, but I haven't seen one that saw the traffic lights before. Yeah. It's new to me. So like right now it doesn't really handle traffic lights yet because um, this is like the lowest level of autonomy that Tesla does. Yeah. Um, so like it, it's like, I need you to tell me that it's okay to go through this light. <laughs> um, but if there was a car in front of me, it would have just followed the car through the light. So it, even if it doesn't have the full self-driving, it still sees everything? Yeah, so like right now it's stopping for traffic control in 300 feet. So well, It has to, right? Like to get the self-driving, they have to be recording this data and be like, all right, right no more it. If I'm getting a Tesla, you need to get some commission. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If you, if you get a Tesla, please use my referral code. Like, Wait, ooh, what kind of commission do you get? Uh, it's like, I don't know. It's, you, you get Tesla credits and you can use it in the store. You can use it for like some... Wait, some merch. You should have got them to put that on your car when they wrapped it. Oh, but we were thinking, thinking about getting a second hand, so. Oh yeah, if you get a second hand, then we, would, we wouldn't be able to get anything from it. Yeah. But that's okay. Um, yeah, you can get like full self, or, uh, full supercharging, free supercharging, sorry. Full self-driving, free mm -hmm. supercharging. Um, there's a handful of different things you can get for free. But. Oh wait, you can get free supercharging? Yeah, from those referrals. Mm -hmm. Which is nice. The person referring or getting referred? Both. Yeah, they both get like five months of free supercharging or something. I, I don't remember the exact numbers. Nice. But yeah. 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 My sister has one of the older Model S's that has just free supercharging forever. forever. Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. I'm assuming she's keeping that. Uh, yep. <laughs> till it dies. She's, uh, yeah, she's gonna drive it into the ground. That's awesome. Way fun. So you like Austin? Yeah, it's great. We, we really like it out there, actually. The people are super nice. Um, How's the weather? Eh, I like it slightly better than Austin, uh, than Mesa, what? but not much better. <laughs> Even the winter? Better weather. I, I like, the, the winter's pretty comparable, in my opinion. It's a little bit colder than here, for sure. Um, but, yeah. At least that 115 degree. I do not summer. miss the 115 degree summer. But it's quite a bit humider there, more more humid there. Um, you can see that because you bike a lot. I do you bike go oh, outside. Oh yeah, I guess biking in the summer would be rough. <laughs> yeah, biking sucked here. <laughs> much, much preferred there. Um, anyways, so there you go. This is uh, the Cybertruck. It's pretty cool. It's really cool. I like the merge camera. Yeah, 
so it's got a full full suit of cameras, obviously, for full, full self-driving. It's got a, a rear view mirror camera that you can put on here if you want, but where you want. And then you can also bring up the full suite if you. That just looks disoriented. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I normally only use this for parking, but it's there. Yeah. So how many hours do you work a week on Tesla? Yeah, so I, they expect 40. I'd probably say I work closer to 45. I really enjoy what I do. It's a lot of fun, uh, and I enjoy the mission. Like I'm, I'm uh, almost all my net worth is invested in Tesla. Um, so every hour I work, the better the company gets, the more money I make, which is fun. And a lot of my compensation is also through stock, and so I am highly incentivized to make sure the company does well. Uh, so yeah, I'd say around 45 hours a week. But I, mean, I could get away with 40. They don't, they don't track anything. It's just as, as long as I'm performing well. I, I don't have to go in every day. Like they don't track it. They, they expect me to go in the office, but I, if I need to work from home, I, I work from home. It's not a problem. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, and I want to do with the kids. That's why. <laughs> yeah. That's, the truth comes out. It, it's really hard to work at home with kids. Fair. <laughs> so I, I thought of that. I much okay. prefer to work from the office. Do you have like four bedrooms over there? Uh, it's a it's a four bedroom plus an office. Oh. So five bedrooms. It's a three thousand square foot house. So that's your like. Can you hear them yeah. at your office? Or? Well, so here's the thing. Of course. I was told. That, I was told that I have to go into the office, and so we convert my office into a playroom. So I no longer have an office. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and I say that I'm the only one on my team, but like the wider team, there's plenty of people, like the support techs and like the. Uh, yeah, but the various people, people that you need to work directly those, with. Yeah, the people that I work directly with uh, are all in Fremont. Every time I go in, I make the argument that they should be glad that I don't go in by trying to stop everyone from working. I do remember that. That, that joke has been long running. <laughs> hey, it was... It made even fun. Bearable. In person. Bearable. <laughs> job more fun when you're, when you're harassing that. people. Uh -huh. Yeah. Now I'm just you guys were good home. sports about it. Now I'm just working from home. Uh, don't really have a lot of human interaction. Yeah. I, I, honestly. I, you don't have either? Every way, way, shape, and form I like, I like working that was better. It's crazy. I understand that most people would like disagree. Old man. I know, right? I was apparently born in the wrong generation. <laughs> But, but but your team is not there. Do you talk to other people? Yeah, I'm I'm very friendly with my larger team. Do you have Taco Bell meetings? <laughs> no, no, we do not. Do you have a designated seat or? Yeah, mm -hmm. I've got a desk. Got a, a big <laughs> big 43 inch monitor and 4K sit down desk. Friend. Quite a bit, yes. <laughs> 25 hours is not too bad. Honestly, I would expect like at least 55. Yeah, I, I think it varies from team to team, and there's definitely like crunch times and times where it's more relaxed. Where we were. Ah, thank you. Um, but I'd say, oh, it's exit only. That one you can enter. Perfect. Uh, but yeah, I'd say on average, I'd, I'd say I work about 45. There are times where I've got like doctor's appointments and stuff, and I sometimes don't get around to making up the hours, and there's times where I'm really pushing to finish something and I work a little longer. But. So you're sure you can't make it to tomorrow, right? I cannot, unfortunately. If you guys wanted to like come over for a game night tonight, or I could come over to your place for a game night tonight, I'd be way down. Um, My in-laws are coming. I was, ah. I was telling you. Yeah, now we leave. Oh, no, I wasn't telling you guys. I was telling my friend. We leave early, early tomorrow morning. Oh, you were telling your friend instead of us. I see how it is, Harry. Yeah, you guys are. Just acquaintances. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, honestly, at this point, I kind of am. Brutal. I'm gonna tell on you to Max and Mason. Oh, thanks for. Uh... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks for. Yeah, thanks. That was awesome. Thanks for coming. It was fun. Let us know next time when you come back. Of course. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah.